Good day YouTube. In this video I want to show you guys how to upgrade to the latest and greatest available Linux kernel for Linux Mint 19.1. Now full disclaimer, uh, it's not always safe. Uh, you can have a lot of bugs and things that come into play here so do back up all your data before you do something like this. It's just not safe otherwise. So in order to do it what you do need to do is go to the update manager and you can hit that up by going to the start menu there as I like to call it go to update manager and then probably expand it a bit then move across to the uh, view menu then go to Linux kernels now as you'll see actually there's the disclaimer the warning that I mentioned a moment ago so it can cause all these types of issues reboots no Wi-Fi blah 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 but uh, the reason why you might be doing this is just purely because uh, you've got later hardware and you want to do it and give it a shot anyway. So let's just go continue. Now at the moment, uh, if you are on a fresh install of Linux Mint 19 and you go to the, the 4.15 uh, box option here, you'll see that this one is installed but not active. In fact, you probably will see it's active as well. I've just actually upgraded mine and I've gone to the 4.18, the latest version. So this is uh, showing as active here. So previously it was not, but I've just done this a moment ago then rebooted my machine so in order to actually install the latest kernel uh, which is in here simply just click on it like you would any of these and hit the install button basically allow that to go through allow that to complete and uh, once it's installed what you will do need to do is do a reset because once you perform a quick command without a reset it won't have actually changed to the uh, to the later uh, Linux Mint, uh, sorry, Linux kernel. So basically, all you do is go to that software update section that I've showed you a moment ago before, go to view, go to Linux kernels, click on the latest kernel that you want, uh, back up all your data first before you do any of this, and then uh, after it's all downloaded, all of that, just go and uh, restart your machine and see if uh, your machine is potentially even less buggy and that might be one of the reasons why you might be doing this. Linux Mint likes to use a slightly older kernel of 4.15 uh, unlike the Ubuntu 4.18 which mine is currently on and the reason is just because it likes to be a little bit more uh, I guess stable and uh, use the older kernel that was with the Ubuntu base packages of Ubuntu 18.04 to which Linux Mint 19.1 is based on so that's pretty much it guys thanks for your time uh, please like please subscribe um, yeah and thanks for watching cheers